Good day everyone, this is Jamie Nicole Egamalo from BSEE 1861. And now I'm going to show you my answer on lecture 4, Conservation of Energy, Momentum, Impulse, and Collisions. So problem set number 1, and check your understanding 8.7 on page 374. So how high above the bottom of its arc is the particle in the sentence pendulum above? when its speed is 0 0.81 meter per second. So the given is speed is equals to 0 0.81 meter per second. So find the h or height. So the solution here is ki or the initial kinetic energy plus ui is equals to final kinetic energy plus uf. So and ki is 0, then plus mgh, which is the ui, is equals to kf, which is 1 half mv squared, plus ang potential energy, final potential energy is 0. So, which, para makuha na itong formula, nga ang height ng ita is mgh over mg is equals to one half mv squared over mg then cancel na to ang tanan mg kay ang height man ang gipangita so nara h or height is equals to one half which is mauna ang final kinetic energy so one half v squared over g then h is equals to one half so ang equivalent sa one half is two times 0 0.81 meter per second squared over 9.81 meter per second squared which is mona ang gravity is equals to 0 0.32805 meter per second squared over 9.81 meter per second squared. So, ang height niya is 0 0.033 m. Problem set number 2 in example 8.8 .8, page 375. Air resistance on a falling object. A helicopter is hovering at an altitude of 1 kilometer when from its underside break loose and plummet to be ground the mass of panel is 15 kilogram and it hits the ground with a speed of 45 meter per second so how much mechanical energy was dissipated by air resistance during panels descent so the given mass is 15 kilogram and the velocity is 45 meter per second and why is equals to 1 kilometer so find the energy dissipated and solution energy dissipated is absolute value of non-conservative work is equals to change of absolute value of change in kinetic energy energy dissipated is equals to kf minus ki plus uf minus ui so kf is one half mv squared minus ki is zero plus uf is zero minus and ui is mgh so ang um, one half and then v mv squared is the mass is 15 kilogram and the velocity is 45 meter per second so 15 kilogram times 45 meter per second squared minus ki is 0 plus 0 minus more japon ang m or mass is 15 kilogram so ang gravity is 9.81 meter per second squared and times to 1000 meters so 
mo ni ang height or kaning y i sa given one k m na siya so then gi convert siya sa into meter so mo nahimo na siya ang one thousand then simplify the fifteen thousand one hundred eighty seven point five plus negative one hundred forty seven thousand so the absolute value is negative one thirty one point eight hundred twelve point five joules then answer is one thirty times ten to the third power so ang energy dissipated is equals to one thirty kilojoules so the problem set number three in example nine point one page four hundred to four hundred three the arizona manure water so approximately fifty thousand years ago a large or radius of twenty five meter iron nickel meteorite collided with earth at an estimated speed of 1.28 times 10 to the fourth power meter per second in what is now the northern arizona desert in the united states the impact produced a crater that is still visible today it is approximately 1200 meter or three quarters of a mile in diameter 170 m depth and has a rim that rises 45 meters above the surroundings desert plain iron nickel meteorites typically have a density of p is equals to 7970 kilogram meters per cube use impulse consideration to estimate the average force and maximum force that the meteor applied to earth during the impact so given is the initial velocity is equals to 1.28 times 10 to the fourth power meter per second and r is 25 meter so the density is equals to 7970 kilogram, kilogram meter per sec per cube so find the force of average and force of maximum so Force of average is equals to so the force of average is equals to impulse over change of time and the force of average is equals to mass change of velocity over change of time then which is the force of average is equals to PV change of velocity over change of time equals to P times four third pi r cube times times v f minus v i over change of time. So seven seven thousand nine hundred seventy kilogram meter per cube and four over third pi times twenty five m cube and zero meter per seconds minus negative 128 times 10 to the fourth power meter per second choose which is mauna ang initial velocity over two seconds so 7970 kilogram meter per cube times 65,286.2 meter cube times 1.28 times 10 to the fourth power meters per second choose so the final average is equals to positive 3.33 times 10 to the 12th power newton choose problem set number four in example 9.3 moving enterprise so mr sulu take us out ahead one quarter impulse with command Captain Kirk of the Starship Enterprise has a ship start from rest to final speed of 1 fourth times 3.0 times 10 to the 8th power meter per second. Then assuming this maneuver is completed in 60 seconds, so what average force did the impulsive engines apply to a ship? Then the given. 
the final speed is equals to 1 fourth and 3.0 times 10 to the 8 power meter per seconds and V is equals to Z 0 meter per seconds and the time is 60 seconds so ang mass of the enterprise which is the 2 times 10 to the 9th power kilogram then find the force or F so delta P is equals to J delta P is equals to mass times change of velocity then J is equals to F change of T so equating this expression gives the F change to T is equals to mass times change of velocity so equating expression gives F change to T is equals to mass change to velocity so F change to T and over change to T so it can sell ang duhaka change of T then equals mass times change of velocity over change of time then force is equals to mass change of velocity over cha change of time okay which means you can okay you can sell manato ang change of time dere so force na lang nabilin then modern is siya yan so F is equals to mass, which is the mass of enterprise is equals to 2 times 10 to the 9th power kilogram. Then times to 7.5 times 10 to the 7th power meter per second over 60 seconds. So, ang force niya is 2.5 times 10 to the 15th power newtons.